You guys, we're uh, spending a little extra time in Miami today. We're at Hanover Park, where a couple weeks ago there was a small kite festival here. And uh, right here in the park is Skyward Kites. We're going to go check out what Skyward Kites is all about. It's an interesting little place here in a very cool flying location. You guys are in the Miami area. This is the place to come to fly. Hanover Park. Hallover Park, sorry. Wander around. So guys, Drayton here, world's greatest kiting. I'm standing here in front of Skyward Kites in a very cool flying location we found here near Miami Beach. Or is this actually is this actually part of Miami Beach? Some call it Miami Beach, yeah. I'm talking to Dan here who owns Skyward Kites right Hello. here in Hallover Park. Today there's some other kiters meeting out here. We're gonna fly together, but Dan, this is a cool spot. How did, for one thing, I'm thinking, how did you manage to get a kite shop right here in like the most perfect location? Believe it or not, we've been here 25 years, right here in this spot. And that's why it's most convenient because we got a shop right here, the kite field right here, the mix, the blend works perfect. And that's why we've been able to make it here 25 years and counting. 25 years? Mm -hmm. This is a really awesome spot. If you guys are in the area, you got to come here to Hallover Park and check this out. But in the shop, I haven't been in here yet. Come on up. But I'll show you what it's, what's in here. So first, you said uh, when kite flyers come out here, they can hang out. Yeah, absolutely. We welcome all kite flyers. Just come and chill, fly kites with us. We'll be putting the music out a little bit later on, and kids running all over the place. It gets kind of like insanity, but uh, yeah. chaotic fun. You said there's a, a birthday party or something. We, we rent this backspace out for kids' birthday parties and they fly kites as well. Oh you know, my gosh. So you can get a bounce house out here. Really a huge area for parties, family events, whatever. But right here is all these kites. Check out all the stuff that he's got. I mean, pretty much everything you need to show up at a park with nothing. And here you go. Here's your whole entire day. What do, you, what do you sell the most up here? What do people love? Uh, well, to be honest, uh, the Little Mermaid and uh, Pirates are number one sellers here. Oh yeah, the Pirate. <laughs> That's right. Everybody loves a Pirate kite. Of course. We're in the Caribbean, aren't we? Yeah. Yeah, right on. Uh, and there, I see you got the, uh, these octopuses are pretty cool. Is that a yeah, octopus, yeah, exactly. Yeah. And food, we've got uh, all the ice cream. Oh, you, guys, look at this. We've got ice cream and drinks here. I got my favorite one. I like the strawberry crunch ones. I, I was thinking it was Spider-Man, but okay. Oh, well, that guy. You know, you got, check out all these wind socks hanging around. You can't miss the place, obviously. Right up here is the road. We just saw some really, we saw some Lamborghinis just Oh, did you see that green driving one? Driving by. Yeah, that was crazy. So you want some action and adventure for your day. You're in the Miami area. Come down here and check out this place, won't you? We're gonna go have some fun flying today. I'll show you some more. First kite of the day, launch. It's really windy. In fact, I looked up on the website, on PRISM's website, how fast of the wind this will tolerate. And it says up to 24 miles per hour, which I'm sure we're at around 20 miles an hour today here at uh, Hallover Park. Miami. So here's how easy this kite goes together. Everything just pops right together. Very easy. Easier to put this in separately. Gonna break it, okay? So if 
you see the shape. One single point at the, on the bridle. simple hook to hook up the kite line to the kite. Let's fly it. out here. If you speak Spanish, and Spanish only, you can still communicate just fine and buy a kite out here at Skyward Kite. This place is awesome. It's really awesome. Hey guys, I'm seeing it out here at Skyward and I just ran into a fellow kiter, Ed? Ed Martin. Martin? Yes. And uh, he's been, this was the first place where he got into kite buggy kite bugging if you look check a look at his hat here yes wearing one of the um, buggy pins <laughs> from Las Vegas from Las Vegas if you guys don't know about kite bugging it is intense intense power kiting fun as heck this guy knows all about it we're gonna talk more about this in some soon upcoming videos but even in this small area well it's not very small this whole over park but you can power kite here you can power it doesn't take a huge amount of space and tell them how fun well, kite buggy is an absolute blast i got yeah, into it about 26 yeah. years ago uh, here at uh, dan here at skyward uh, kites here and uh, i um first had friends with ray and Jeannie murray from cobra kites hey ray and um so uh, yeah hey ray hey Jeannie, how are you Isn't that great? and so anyway good seeing you again anyway uh anyway so we're personal friends of mine we went out to las vegas and there's a lot of kite bugging out there and a lot of dining and fun out there. There at Buffalo Fields and, and uh, there's the sawgrass, but we had a really great time out there. But uh, I think there's going to be more from this Ed guy and from this guy. Oh, there's Dan. Well, why don't we just cut it right here and then tie it back on again? How's that sound? Occupational hazard. The kite flying. <laughs> You know, look like fun to you guys because it you know, kind of looks like fun to me. You know Lewis, right? He's one of our big red flyers here. Oh, yeah, I know Lewis. He really? knows me before okay. Kuwait. Lewis is an excellent kite I flyer. If you guys see these knows. guys on the field, you better. I taught, I taught Lewis everything meet him. he knows. It took me about 30 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> well, what are you teaching him about how to undo a knot here? Um, well, this is a good one. Um, this is what you. This is what you do not want to do. <laughs> but um, but this is a good day of kite flying. You know, you could be sitting at the office.
set, making sure everything's perfect, and answering a telephone call. this this power blast this kite is insane it is so strong it is incredibly fast you guys are quad line flyers and have not flown this that's what you're getting into if you're looking for some adventure get one of these power blasts they're so fun and on a day when it's 20 mile an hour wind that's what you want does it look like he's having a bad time back there I can't even keep the camera on it because it is so fast and a lot of it once you get a little bit of air under that sail it is moving it is just going so fast Had a successful day of flying out here. Thanks again. Oh, for this come out and really nice to have you guys out flying, enjoying this beautiful wind out there. Yeah, today. it's been really fun. So check this out too. Look at it, guys. So when you come out here to buy your next kite, say hi. Check out the sticker and enjoy your day because this is an easy place to do that. Anything you want to say to everybody before? Hope we end the here. vlog. Hope to see you here. Bye. Anything you want to say to everybody before we end the day? I like kites. Scott likes kites. Have a good day. I'll see you tomorrow. Happy flying. And more from Orlando, Florida tomorrow. <laughs> so this is what happens when you uh, when your pipe bursts. Ha, ha, ha.